All right, this is going to be a weird way to intro a video because uh, this isn't the way we traditionally do things. But while I was here trying to level up my combat shotgun, get it ready to record a video for zombies, I found this insanely broken spot where you can literally just grind camos while not doing anything. Uh, you might be able to hear, I, I don't know if I've kept the game audio in, but if not, I'll put it in right now. You can hear my shotgun going off. The reason why is I've set up a macro. I constantly sit here and shoot at this spot here on Hotel Royale. Let me turn it off real quick so I can look around. Oh, wait, it's still on. Turn off. But I set a macro to click every few seconds, like you can see here. But we got a harvest vent, and we are on the third area here for the Sin Eater, where it's sitting right over to my right. And on this little spot here, zombies only climb up from one spot, and that's right in front of you. So if you are on PC... You can set up a macro on whatever device you have. For me, I have Steel Series, so it was pretty easy to set up a macro. And it'll just sit here and continuously shoot. I don't have to do anything. And I have the Ammo Gremlin Covenant, which instantly reloads my weapon at Legendary, so I don't have to even think about reloading. And then I also have Unholy Ground, which is getting me my Covenant uh, camos. So right about now, I think I'm at like 1,600 Covenant kills, and I'm, I'm literally doing nothing. I found this spot by accident. I was just kind of grinding camos trying to get ready to get this thing like gold viper and I, I just found out that i don't have to do anything like uh, trying to set this video up even though you can't pause in zombies i was just throwing decoys to make sure they stay away from me so i can take my mouse off screen you know get all my recording stuff set up i had time to do all that while i was still in game unlocking camos like this is absolutely broken if zombies xp was a little better this would be an insane way to like get all the way up max level i'm already i think prestige three it, it says zero once you prestige in this uh on here for some reason I'm already prestige three. As you can see, I have 2,700 kills, 915 crits. Like it's absolutely absurd. The amount of just kills I'm getting here doing nothing. But in these harvest rounds, elites will not spawn unless you move the sin eater. So right after you move the sin eater, you'll probably get some boom shriekers and MGKs or what are they called? They're the, just the, the dudes with the machine guns. So those guys will come around after you move it, but that's only immediately after. And it's set to a certain amount. Hold on, stop shooting. I need to grab some ammo. That's all you got to do. Once you start running out of ammo, you can just come right back here. Drop down to the field of zombies that you're just killing. I almost just ruined the whole thing. But you just have to jump down to all that loot from all the zombies you're just taking out. And then you're instantly refilled. And you can go back to just doing nothing. Like, I can just go, I don't know, make food or something. And still keep getting camo progress. Like, this is absolutely absurd. And I figured I'd show you guys. And we might as well just start our grind here. Uh, I can show our build. I'll probably put up on screen right here. So this is the build that we were using. I'm pretty sure it's a sawed off. Pistol, smile, grip. It's, I think, the biggest mag you can have with this. And then the other attachments, I'm not too sure on. So they'll be on the screen for you. But as you can see, I'm just sitting here unlocking camos, doing nothing. Like, I can't even explain how clutch this is. This is a very weapon-specific thing. I think this will only be with shotguns because this will only fill up shotguns fast enough. And shotguns are a one-hit kill. So we are here on, like, wave 11. And we're, we're already fully pack free. We have our covenants up so it's very very situational you have to have your covenants up you have to have the right weapon and you have to get the right harvest event because there are a few harvest events here on hotel royale so this was like the perfect storm for me just being lazy and honestly i'm not mad about it this is so ridiculously broken like i don't it's it, i guess it, it fits this mode right like it, it really fits vanguard zombies at the moment like it's just free camos for me and i will take it all day so i'm gonna let it do its thing until i'm done with all of my 4,000 eliminations and 4,000 and pack a bunch of eliminations all my covenant eliminations all that good stuff and then once this thing is finally done we will get our elite kills together we still need to get probably about like i don't even know it could be like 40 boom shrieker kills and then i think four more machine gun kelly kills which should be interesting because we're already at round 11 so i guess i'll see you guys once we get that done All right, I'm pretty sure I'm all done with all my eliminations now. I just got my 4,000 Pack-a-Punch kills. Now, I'm gonna go ahead and end this event. Let me stop my macro. It has a few more clicks left in it. Uh, I really wanna just sit here and just keep killing just to see how much Operator XP I can get because this would be a nice way to just level up my Operator completely because this is the Operator whose favorite weapon is the Combat Shotgun, but... I think I'll end it here. That's enough for that. What I really want to show is look at all these bullet holes here. Me just sitting here shooting. I just completely messed up this roof. It is ridiculous. But now we have a, a real big challenge here. We have to get 
I think like maybe even 40 boom shrieker kills. So hopefully a lot spawn. It wasn't too difficult last time we did it, but we're at a way higher round now. I, I was really expecting to come into this game, maybe get half done and then be able to just start recording. But we have so much now. We have all three legendary covenants. Our weapon is pack three. We have four gamma bombs, a decoy. Frost blast is fully leveled and these zombies are so much stronger now. I, I think this is probably the highest wave I've been to. Let's go see if we can find some boom shriekers. There's got to be some around here. Where you at, Boom Shriekers? There's one in there. Got him. I might have spawned another one. Yep. Easy. We got to get MGK as well. Oh, there's two of them. Get back. Easy camo. What one was that? All right. Well, I'm, I'm going to assume that was uh, an MGK one. I'm going to... I can just go ahead and upgrade all my perks right now. So I'll do that. There we go. Stamina ups all the way up. Let's upgrade Quick Revive. Speed Cola is really, really useless right now because it auto reloads. We'll do that. Maybe the Speed Cola actually increase your uh the rate that you get your field upgrade back in this game or is that only a cold war thing but we can get this all the way up there we go we got everything we need now let's try to find some more boom shriekers anybody in here oh there's mgk cross blast i don't think that counted for us man there's another guy right here though so it doesn't matter too much to make sure we get this kill please die thank you i didn't see a camo pop up for that oh wait yeah i did i was lying we're at 18 so we need two more of those guys and I don't even know how many boom shriekers. So this is going to be tough. Let me make sure I'm checking everywhere before we head into this next event and we can get all that done. It's kind of nice though. Uh, it, it's a bit of a different challenge here. But if you guys ever do get Hotel Royale and you have your third area there, honestly, if you get Hotel Royale at all, you can go there. The zombies will just come to you. I guess the spawn doesn't really matter of where the, the Sin Eater's at. But I guess one area for the uh, Sin Eater to sit at probably makes the spawns faster. But either way, it's just no effort kills. All you got to do is get up every once in a while and make sure you got ammo. We'll try this transfer event probably should have got armor but it's whatever or self-revive because if i go down it's over i don't have one all right let's go dude get moving come on let's go on your way and we're off come on there you go just needs a little encouragement Ooh, this thing is not one-shotting zombies anymore unless it's crits which is scary i don't like how high of a round i'm on keep moving come on there's a boom shrieker gone any more want to spawn it's so weird i keep going to like instinctively cod reload but this thing is auto reloading everything for me like i really don't need to there's got to be a boom shrieker coming now keep moving Jeez, i have to be so careful at around this high come on keep going keep going keep going keep going no time to waste here why don't i just gamma bomb these guys there's literally only one zombie but i had to do it no more boom shriekers literally only one this is gonna be tough oh wait i hear one there we go that's another one i heard two Where'd the other one spawn at? All right, I'm gonna gamma bomb these guys. Easy. There's another boom shrieker. I'd like to see. Oh, there's Big Daddy. MGK, get out of here. Okay, he did. He literally just disappeared in the thin air. Shut up, Vaughn. You didn't even say anything. You literally just popped up and was were silent, but shut up. Any covenants? Uh, we already have three legendary. I just like to check. So I'm gonna go grab a self revive. Oh, easy calling card. Well, let's grab a self revive. Let's craft armor tier three. Get off of me. Oh, there's a boom shrieker coming. I can't be caught off guard. Gotta make sure we kill him. I hear another one. Let's search the map for him. There we go. Marshland. What is that? 70. We need 30 more boom streakers on round 13. That's a big yikes. I think we can do it. We have to try. We don't find insane methods like that for them to go to waste. This is this could be our first like gold viper in one game. We already had this thing fully leveled up for multiplayer. Like as you guys have probably seen, if you you're connected to the multiplayer scene in this game, the shotguns are absolutely busted right now. They're all anyone's using on a DOS house, and it's just completely insane. They go so hard. I've I've seen so many nukes be dropped with these. It's ridiculous. Oh, another boom shrieker. Shalit. I don't think there's any more in here, so I'll leave these zombies be. This big poppy, though. Please die. I think this is our last one. There we go. Show me the camo. Stormwatch. We got a calling card and 150 storm Kriegers gone. And our challenge is done for this shotgun. Let's just try to get these boom shriekers to keep spawning. It looks like we're getting a whole lot of MGK spawning. I'm just going to run away from them. They're slow. Who cares? Boom shrieker. Sleep. Boom shleeper. I hear another one, though. Oh, there's two. Easy. Just got to keep moving though these guys are no joke holy shit are there any over here the spawns in this this hub area are weird it seems like they're opposite of whatever they were last time you're in the hub let's check the main building oh we have a blitz next that's gonna be really really tough to survive we're just gonna check anybody here anyone at all not looking like it oh shit the entire horde of zombies coming at me from over here. Looks like no no boom shriekers have spawned. I'm starting the blitz up. How long do blitzes last now? Like three minutes at this rate? This is going to be awful. Especially since last time we were playing them in the timer reset. It might have just been a visual thing, but that that's going to be scary up this high of a round. Okay, actually, maybe not because we can just go to our spot. Oh, no, we can't. 
No, we can't. It's blocked off. We can go to this spot, though. This ain't too bad. But after sitting there and just watching the game play itself, you kind of realize how long it takes to just grind in this. 4,000 eliminations isn't hard, but it's like, man, that's just so much time wasted doing nothing. I hear a boom shrieker. There it is. Sleep. This is a pretty easy blitz round. Knock on wood. Oh, there's Big Daddy. Gotta take him out because he's gonna try to piss on our parade. Please die. These things have so much fucking health. There we go. And now we're right back up. There's a whole lot coming. I'll just cross blast. Easy. At least the one thing we have to kill is always gonna be a one shot. At least I think so. It seems like it'll always be a one shot. So we can kind of just train around everything else. Really just focus on these guys. That was definitely not a one shot right there. So that's that's tough. Okay, we're at 80 though. I need 20 more. I hear it. Where are you, Boom Shrieker? There you are. Gone. We only have 20 seconds to survive here. This guy over here could stop shooting at me. That'd be fantastic. We'll just move back over here. Boom Shrieker leave we can get this done especially if there's a few back at the hub we only need to do like one more event and we'll, we'll be golden because i don't want to risk trying to do the exfil and not enough spawning but we made it through that was kind of tough a shotgun's damage is starting to fall off the zombie's health is getting too high all right let's repair our armor because we desperately needed this high up and we're still on the search for boom booms i hear them there they are i think there's two right there actually I heard another one there he is Where's the rest of your friends? We have a harvest event next. And that's going to be a little tougher to do. Because with Blitz, all we got to do is survive. With Harvest, we have to kill. Okay, I'm seeing a lot of big daddies. Some MGKs, but no Boom Shriekers. There's one. Being in this building is probably the worst place to hang out. But if Boom Shriekers are in here, then I'm there. I can hear one. I just don't know where it is. Oh, here's one. Easy. Okay, I think we about pissed off every zombie that's in that building. So hopefully they kind of try to chase out. I heard one. What's up, pal? Yeah, I'm starting up a harvest event. Amethyst, we're at 90, so we just need 10 more and we're done. I don't trust that exactly 10 will spawn in an exfil, so we're gonna do the harvest event. All right, this is gonna be tough because we have to get five kills where they drop ruins and then we have to put all the ruins into the harvest thing. And we have to stand still to do that. Are these zombies faster or am I tweaking? They're definitely faster. Holy shit, they're sprinting. Good thing we got stamina up. Drop ruins now. Thank you. All right, we have three decoys to work with here and we have mother load i think is the name of the covenant that makes it possible to drop extra so it's not that bad i kind of want to train around to see how many boom shriekers it would spawn i think there's limited spawns on harvest rounds like it'll only spawn like x amount at a time like they'll still spawn infinitely but you only get like eight at a time or something like that depending on the round so we have to eliminate a few of these oh shit frost blast i can't be cornering myself not if i want this Gold Viper. Jeez, these guys are insanely fast. I'll throw a decoy down while I put these in. Get a few kills because we need some more runes. Oh, shit. It's big fella. MGK spawned, but are we getting any Boom Shrieker spawns is the question. I don't think so, so I'm putting two more in. We'll pick up this decoy. Oh, I hear one. I hear two. Maybe even three. Where are they at? There we go. I said I might have heard three. I've only seen one. Okay, there's two. Gone. I don't see number three. Looking like I might have swindled myself here. I'm going to decoy down. Get to the decoy, please. Holy shit. Is that decoy just non-existent? There we go. Please, I had to throw two of them. All right, we'll just kill these guys. I hear another one. Where you at, buddy? I just want to talk. I'm going to just keep throwing decoys so I can focus on them only. There we go. I'm going to gamma bomb those guys. Go back here, pick up this decoy. There's a big dude. I'd rather just end it. Uh-oh. We need one more rune. So I'm not going to sit here and waste my time shooting him when I can just put one rune in and he's dead. And we can get more boom shrieker spawns. So only a few are going to spawn here. I think we should be good. There should be enough back at base for us to get the finish finish off this challenge. I think this is perfect. There we go. Oh, there's another MGK. Why so many MGK? Is there actually two of them? That's not okay. I'm gonna try to lead them away from the harvest. Holy shit. They're actually might kill me. I was so low there. Oh, there's a boom streaker. No, my gamma bomb killed it. I didn't know you're gonna spawn little guy. We still need to get five runes somehow. Oh wait, these big guys, I don't think are that. Yeah, they are pretty hard to kill actually. I lied. I was gonna say, I don't think they are, but they're tanking a lot of damage. You know what? There we go. Nothing I can't handle. I keep getting that challenge every time I, I kill one of them, saying that I've killed 150. We've been known that. Some more runes I gotta pick up too. That might be all the, the boom screechers that we get. So I gotta put a decoy down, get these guys the hell away from me. Let's load these in, head back to the hub. Hopefully there's enough there and then we can exfil. I, I think we're fine now. All right, check the covenants just because I like looking at them. Nothing crazy. Repair the armor. Did boom streaker still spawn at this hive around? I sure hope so. I hear one. Oh, there's one right there. Are they three shot now? That's insane. There's another one. Yeah, they are three shot. What the? 
fuck happened? We gotta be like two away. That's my guess. There's gotta be one down here. Really? No. I heard him spawn now. There we go. Is that it? That's it. Show me gold viper. 100 boom streak eliminations. Let's go. Complete all challenges for this weapon. Golden viper, baby. That's what we like to see. So I'm gonna start X fill. Easy. We will grab some more gamma bombs and another decoy. We need to kill 47 zombies. These zombies are a two shot kill now with the shotgun. They are extremely fast as well. Not as easy to train as in Cold War. They kind of move around a bit more. So I'm throwing a decoy. Please go to it. I'll give them a second to all group up to it. I think that's a big enough group. Gamma bomb. Literally kills them all. Oh, shit. It's Big Papa. Need to kill 30 more zombies somehow. Let's run to the area that they're in. Oh, what's up, Papa? Let's throw another decoy down. Please go to it. Please enjoy the decoy. Go ahead. Group up at it. Don't be shy. And eat that. That's a big chunk of zombies gone. We got 19 more to kill, so I'll throw one more decoy. Get on over here. Let's try this. Eight more. Now it's all gone. Where's our portal? We have one frost blast to make it through. Yeah, portal spawned over here. Perfect. Everybody get the hell out of my way. I'm throwing a decoy just in case. And we're hitting the expel. We're gone. Goodbye. We did it. That was insane. I can't believe we found that spot. I think that's only going to be useful for shotguns because with other weapons, it does not reload your gun fast enough. But here are our final stats. 4,618 eliminations, 1,500 crits. I went down twice. We didn't see most of this game. I didn't think I was going to be recording, but we knocked it out pretty well. Let's see how many levels we got from that. Oh, we fully ranked up our guy, our, our operator, which is nice. That's another operator down. So we have, wait, what? It said 20. Why is it only at 19 now? Oh, okay. All right. I see how it is. Almost have four fully leveled up operators, but let's go look at our camos. All right. This is what the combat shotgun looks like with gold viper. This looks so nice. I can't get over this gold viper. I had somebody in the comments saying that gold viper should be renamed to crimson viper. I feel like the viper should be dropped from it completely. Just crimson would be a good name for it. So thank you to whoever commented that. I'm sorry. I can't remember your name, but this camo is amazing. It's neither gold nor viper, but I I like how it looks a lot. Okay. I really like this Plague Diamond. I never noticed that the texture is actually kind of like scaled. It's kind of like stained glass the way it looks. That is beautiful. I really like the rose gold on this. Just please update the diamond texture. I'm going to say that every video. Come on. And this is it with Dark Aether. I I don't know. It really... I, I, I It's not too late to change the Sledgehammer. It's not too late. I know some people like the green, but I feel like it doesn't make any sense. Because the Dark Aether is red. Make it red. Watch this. I'll make it red right now. Bam. Now it's red. Wouldn't that be... Doesn't does this look way better? red yeah yeah that's what i thought anyways let's go see what it looks like in game all right we're back at the thumbnail tree this is what the combat shotgun looks like in game with gold viper i love this you can see all the metallic the metal parts of the weapon are that crimson red and the rest of it is that black laminate when you even on the inside of the weapon it is textured so you shoot it you go to pump it back you can see the crimson red call out on whatever part of that gun is i'm not a gun buff i don't know but it looks really nice even on the grip here of the weapon there's like a crimson ring around the pump action which is very nice all the accents are red this is the best version of gold viper we've ever seen we haven't seen gold viper very much but this blows last year's out of the water completely I'm already out of ammo for it. But I'm sorry, this video is a little more weird than usual. I was not expecting to be recording, but we found that spot and I had to because, you know, you can, you know, you can't pause zombies games. So I had to just jump on it. But I think the spot only really works with shotguns because with that covenant that re auto reloads your gun for you when it's legendary only does it at a certain rate. And the rate at the which shotgun shoots is slower than the rate that it reloads. So that's basically infinite ammo in your shotgun or at least not being able to reload but all those kills you get basically infinite ammo you just go pick up all the ammo that's on the ground so we basically just got free 2,000 kills there i think i was already at 2,000 by the time i did it i think it took about a half hour of what i'm gonna speed up here in the video of it just auto killing all the zombies which you know it's it saves me my my mental strain of sitting there doing it uh it saves my mouse from not having to click too much but you know i i just thought this was a really cool strat and i'd show you guys but i think that's where i'm gonna at the end of the video so if you guys like this and you want to see more go ahead and leave a like on it if you didn't you don't dislike if you're new here please start to subscribe and put out all kinds of COD content throughout the week that's gonna be it for me today i'll see you guys next time later